going. You've spent a long day today learning about all things cloud native data management or CNDM, which by the way is quite a mouthful. <laughs> well, in case you don't know me, I'm Priyanka Sharma and I'm the general manager of the Cloud Native Computing Foundation. I am so thrilled to be here today. I've been really impressed with all the hard work that you have put into learning about this area of Cloud Native. But I'm probably preaching to the choir here. You know this is important, so you took the time. Regardless of where you are in your journey, I wanna tell you something today. You are on a path that is not alone. You are on a path that all of us in Cloud Native are walking. It is the path of progress. I believe this path is built with solidarity, community, diversity, and that is what has made Cloud Native the building blocks of our times. Our journey began years ago when Kubernetes was hailed as the solution for stateless workloads with container orchestration. But as you know, again, probably better than anyone else, reality hit us sooner than we'd expected. Very quickly, every business was becoming a technology business and all workflows were moving online. That's something we have seen ex particularly accelerated during the COVID pandemic too. We realized that if we were going to delight our users, their human experience with technology had to be seamless. It had to be beautiful and it had to be ever iterating to changing user needs. DevOps and Cloud Native were the answer. What does that mean? That means that all applications needed to be shipped fast and resiliently. And that was true regardless of whether they had stateful or stateless workloads or all of or both of them. There are many who came before us and educate us today on how we should move forward. Think the CSI container storage interface and SIG storage. Their work, your work, everybody's work in the community has had results. By the time we had the 2020 Cloud Native Annual Survey Report, the responses stated that 55% of workloads were running on Kubernetes as stateful. Projects such as OpenEBS, Rook, Longhorn, and Chubao FS have supported these efforts. Today, Cloud Native is evolving at breakneck speed. What started as a chill, meandering path has entered freeway territory. <laughs> the pandemic era has proven Cloud Native to be the building block of all kinds of technologies as our lives have shifted online. I will talk more about this in my keynote tomorrow, but suffice it to say, we are seeing innovation in all kinds of industries, from healthcare to food deliveries to energy companies, and all of it is happening with Cloud Native. You in the CNDM community, you are part of this journey. It is you after all, who will bring your expertise around data management and the DevOps way of thinking about data to the engineering organization near you. It is you who will craft the solutions to manage the data generated by AI ML workflows or edge devices in 5G environments, or really whatever the cloud native community conjures up next. You are the data bastion for us. <laughs> Today, you have learned so much. Be proud of yourself. Know that not only are you expanding your own knowledge, but you are really part of something bigger, where we have all come together, each with our own skill sets, to create the future for the best human experience with technology. Take what you have learned today and connect those dots at the main event starting tomorrow. I have to say, our journey together will be a little bittersweet tomorrow as we participate 
in what, fingers crossed, will be our last virtual only KubeCon, Cloud Native Con. I say bittersweet because being virtual has meant so many of us can be in the same space virtually. We can have so many multi-threaded conversations at the same time. People from so many countries can meet each other without any barriers. So I say make the most of it tomorrow and through the rest of your meet week. Meet new people, share your ideas, get feedback and help others. And guess what? Because we are using the CNCF Slack as our commons gathering, the new relationships you build, the conversations you have will be stateful and will not be lost after the event. <laughs> and the journey will continue, but with more friends walking alongside us because we in Cloud Native, we believe in stateful relationships. We believe in persistent relationships. <laughs> well, now that I have exposed how I extend metaphors and my terrible sense of humor, <laughs> I shall bid thee adieu. I look forward to seeing you again at my keynote tomorrow, May 5th at 10 a.m. CEST. If you haven't gotten your tickets to the main conference yet, do not hesitate, do that now. I promise my jokes will be ever so slightly better. There'll be lots of cool stories and new things you will learn. So until then, so long, farewell, and au revoir.